Hey guys, it's Turner4590, and welcome back to Let's Play Sonic Adventure 2 Battle! Uh, in the last part, we finished Hero Story, so we finished Hero, and we finished Chow, which is the most important bit. You have to finish Chow Garden. You have to 100% of the Chow Garden. Once you 100% of the Chow Garden, you unlock story Last Story. You don't have to 100% of the Chow Garden, I'm just joking. Uh, anyway, once you complete Hero and Dark, you unlock Last. Uh, but before we go to Last, I'm actually going to quickly uh, drop by Hero Story, specifically this chapter, Rescuing Sonic, and go to the end of Tails level, Prison Lane. And at the very end of the Tails level, like I showed you way, way before, if you flip the camera and you shoot that gun robot, you can blow this up. And once you have the Vulcan Cannon from the, one of his future levels, Eternal Engine, I believe it is, you can grab this! the laser blaster and this will be very useful in last story and now that we've done that uh, I'm going to quickly go back to dark story the very first level the beginning uh, and about midway through the level uh, to get a the exact same power up except for Eggman about a minute into the level uh, you'll come across this uh, stack of crates and if you blow this up you'll get the exact same thing uh, the exact same thing it just does more damage and the laser blast is a lot more powerful Okay, now that that's done, uh, we are ready to move on with the finale of Sonic Adventure 2 Battle, so let's go. Last story. What's going on? What, what happened? Doesn't the cannon fire? What? So yeah, all what the emeralds are there, so... Here? Long time no see, treasure hunter. <laughs> you haven't given up yet. This straight up has the it's same all point again. For us. What? what do you mean? I just received a message from my boss. This space colony arc is currently approaching the Earth at an incredible velocity. It probably will impact Earth. You've got to be kidding me. So instead of being blown to What's bits, that? we're just gonna be vaporized to bits, or maybe the other way around. We're all gonna die! This is a death sentence for every human being on Earth. If my calculations are correct, the space colony arc will impact the Earth in 27 minutes and 53 seconds. All of you will be destroyed, along with your beloved planet Earth. Oh, well, that's a bit, um, that got dark quickly. <laughs> I mean, Eggman was already planning on destroying the world, but, uh, I don't know, something about seeing an insane man in a straitjacket makes it a bit worse. I plan to give you a taste of my revenge once all the seven Chaos Emeralds are collected. Once I initiate this program... Also, it was rigged to do it no matter what. God damn it. Jesus Christ, that is dark. I plan to give you a taste of my revenge. The vibration's getting What's worse. This? Professor Gerald Robotnik, one of the greatest scientific minds in the world, and my grandfather. What? <laughs> I knew. Hey man, you shouldn't be proud of this. this. Well, I guess Stop you should because right you're already held in on world have done destruction, this a long but still. Time ago if I had the chance. What do you mean? Oh, by the way, I'm alive. Hi. You're pretty persistent for a hedgehog, aren't you? You're still alive. <laughs> Just letting Knuckles pilot the shuttle on the way over here was more dangerous than you could ever be. What is this? This is my grandfather's diary. This shirt certainly won't have some creepy stuff in it. I don't quite know what happened or what went wrong. Was it a mistake to create the ultimate life form? I thought it would be something that would benefit mankind, but then the military guards landed on the colony that day. They were sent to destroy the research project that I had been working on. 
my colleagues at the research facility, my granddaughter, Maria. I hope you are all safe. The name keeps popping up. The, the colony is completely, completely shut down, down probably, probably to keep the prototype from falling, from falling into the wrong hands. Into the wrong hands. The art was shut down under the premise that there had been an accident. I found Maria's name among those who died when the art was shut down. She oh, meant man. everything to me, and I couldn't bear the thought that she died because of my research. I lost everything. I had nothing more to live for. I went insane. All I could think about was to avenge her. Somehow, some way. I got scared as I no longer was able to control my thoughts. All I could think about was that I wanted it all to Based on my original projections, I was able to complete my project, Shadow. I designed its mind to be perfect, pure. I will leave everything to him. So he's in on it from the very beginning. Release and awaken that motherfucker. If you wish to fill the world with destruction. Oh, so that's why you released Shadow from the base. I mean, once again, Eggman was already planning on destroying the Earth, but still. If the colony collides with Earth, it will shatter into pieces like my grandfather pretty. That mad scientist! <laughs> that should be you, right? We have to stop the space colony now! Yeah, we sort of don't want Earth to blow up. Position may have shifted due to the amount of energy given off by the emeralds. We have to and I guess the reason Eggman's helping us is because he was just using the Eclipse Cannon as a threat. He didn't, I don't think he wanted to destroy Earth because, you know, he sort of wanted to conquer it, not completely annihilate it, so. Gerald's going a bit too far here. Yeah, it can do whatever it wants. It can also change shape. <laughs> it was massive in the previous game, and it was pretty big in the beginning game, and now it's tiny. This size is like a Pokeball. <laughs> Go Pikachu! There still may be some time left. If we pull together, we might be able to get to the shortcut that leads to the core. Just gotta scan these blurry blueprints. No worries. Just leave it to me. I'm the world's fastest hedgehog. Hey. Let's get to We'll show that creep the real superpower of teamwork. System alert. System alert. Okay, final level of the entire game, Cannon's Core. This level's cool, because it basically you get to play as every character and you just get to go through the cannon, uh, the cannon's core and is every character. It's just how cool is that? Uh, more games gotta do that uh, more often. Uh, well, I guess Sonic 06 did, but it did it very poorly. <laughs> anyway, uh, this level is awesome, and you know, honestly, Last Story um, is a Sonic tradition, and I'd probably say this is easily the strongest Last Story in the entire series. Really awesome, and it's really epic. Anyway, the first, uh, first up is Tails, and um, uh, not really much to say. Uh, I got the, uh, that upgrade lets us fire a little blue, uh, 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 blue rockets now, and they do much more damage. Not sure if it helps that much, but, you know, it doesn't hurt to get. Also, we can freeze time by hitting those switches. Uh, oh, here, this part's a bit frustrating on your first playthrough, but I managed to get that. Anyway, if we go up here, there we go. Aw, oh, nuts. Okay, um... There we go. You gotta freeze time like that, and then you can uh, hop up here. And we blow open this door. There we go. And that's the tail section done. All right. Moving straight onto the Eggman section, which is more of the same. It's actually very similar, except now we're just playing with Eggman. And once again, I got the same upgrade, so now he shot fires a more powerful beam. And you know what, I guess I'll just use this opportunity right now to talk about uh, my thoughts about the game, because like, we're wrapping up all the little different story arcs. Um, 
So I guess we'll just talk about uh, the mech sections. Honestly, the mech sections in this game are just okay. The, uh... They, um, I definitely prefer in Sonic Adventure DX when you actually got to control Tails. For Eggman, it makes sense to have the mech levels, but I feel like they could have, uh, they maybe could have had a bit of variety and had Tails pilot a, uh, they had, could have had Tails levels where he flies, um, and Eggman levels where he pilots the mech, but then they wouldn't be able to do Eggman versus Tails boss fights. Actually, yeah, they could have found a way. I don't know. Like, they... They had to keep, like, the stories exactly the same, so, oh, wait, the, I mean the gameplay styles, so it's just, I don't know, I definitely prefer the flying sections. Oh, but, it, like I said, it just makes more sense for Eggman, because, you know, like, Tails just all of a sudden has a giant mech for some reason out of the Cyclone. Anyway, this, uh, section's a bit harder, because, uh, the, there's a lot of blocks that are blocking your way, but, uh... Ah, uh, nuts. I don't know how to get through that door. That's a tough door to get through. Anyway, dodge the artificial chaos. Yeah, dodge the artificial chaos! Yeah, I got through that entire area without, uh... Without, um, getting hit. That's awesome. Anyway, just freeze time you dive down there. But yeah, the, the mech sections aren't terrible. Uh, I'd probably say they're the weakest aspect of this game. Also, the weakest aspect of this game is dying horribly like that. Oh, yeah, I got through! Sweet! And there's a chow key that I will be skipping. Oh, it's just a mystic melody. That's a disappointment. Okay, I was hoping there was something actually good down there, but no, there wasn't. Uh, anyway, uh, I'd probably say the mech, mech levels are the weakest aspect of this game. Um, even more so than the Knuckles levels. And I definitely, uh, not only do I prefer the Tails levels in Sonic Adventure DX to these, but I would also, I'd also say that I prefer the, uh... I, I... Come on. Yes! Oh, that's a tough jump, but I was able to get that. I also say I prefer the E102 Gamma sections from Sonic Adventure DX as well. Uh, so that's a shame. But that's it for the mech sections, no more. Okay. Okay, it's time for the final Rouge level of the game. This time we've got to drain the liquid. And basically, what we got to do is we got to... This, uh, the, the Knuckles and Rouge seconds is actually a bit of a puzzle uh, the first time. But basically what we got to do is flip that time switch and then dive through this waterfall right there. And not get hit by that gun soldier. That's a bad idea. Uh, you can do this uh, in time... Uh, before you have to hit the NAR switch, but it's very, very difficult. Anyway, let's hit that switch. Ah, oh, I hit it at the wrong time. It's cool that they saved a gameplay me a game. I... What? I hit the fucking switch, game. Fuck you. There we go. It's cool that they save a new mechanic just for the last story just by itself. So that's cool. Anyway, uh, hit that. And then that. Yes, I know, Eggman. We gotta drain the liquid! Okay, now let's activate time again. Uh, that was the worst possible time to act. I didn't know there was a thing right there. Okay, I completed that uh, thing as Rouge again, and now it's time to get out of here. No! Ah, oh, damn it! We can't get out. We need to find that switch again. There we go. There we go. And now we press the switch. And drain the liquid. Okay, and this is the easily the hardest section of Cannon's Core right here. Uh, this part is, well actually, maybe maybe the second hardest part. It's definitely the hardest to, to do. Uh, this is what I was talking about when I, uh, I recommended getting the air necklace, because this basically this entire section is underwater. So you constantly have to keep finding air bubbles and stuff, and it's very, very difficult unless you uh, grab the air necklace, because now we can just breathe underwater 
uh, infinitely. Anyway, this section is really, really difficult for for your first time, and this, yeah, like, this is either the second hardest or the hardest section of Cannon's Core easily. Anyway, uh, if we just uh, not do that. Uh, anyway, we need to quickly go over here and grab this time switch, but then rush. Nope. Game, come on. There we go. Now we gotta rush our asses over here. Because we gotta get into this tunnel and get to the other side before the time stops. And you just have barely enough time to get to the end. It's kind of ridiculous how little time you have. Uh, anyway, we just dive down here, and here's another switch. Let's hit this. Nope. Oh, god damn it. The, the hit detection on these time switches is a bit derpy. Okay, we gotta hit this. There we go. Swim to the side here. Okay, once again, I'm making this look a lot easier than it is. On your first playthrough, this part's just really, really tough. And that does it for the knuckle section. Okay, and final level of Cannon's Core, of course, Sonic. Uh, Shadow doesn't join in on the fun because, you know, he wants the entire world destroyed. His master's wishes, unfortunately. And I died. Okay, as I was saying before, I died like an idiot. Uh, that artificial chaos glitch, <laughs> that was weird. Anyway, we have to hit the artificial... Okay, my homing attack glitched that time. That wasn't fair. Basically, the, the, like, the door behind us is closed, so we have to kill all the artificial chaos to open the door. There we go! That's what you're supposed to do. Or maybe you're not supposed to hit that artificial chaos, and I'm just an idiot. Uh, anyway, let's hit that. Uh, not die, I have zero lives game. Okay, let's get through here. Roll through here. There we go. And bounce. There we go. And that's the harder part of the level done. Now, this is weird, but uh, if you go down there, uh, I'm not... I think it's actually you die if you go down there. You have to jump up here. I could be totally wrong on that. I've actually never... I don't... Like, I, I haven't gone down there since, like, maybe my first playthrough, so... I, maybe you don't die. I don't know what happens, because I always jump up the waterfall. And anyway, this is pretty cool. This reminds me of uh, Mystic Ruins from... Uh, from uh, Sonic Adventure DX, which I think is what they were going for. And that's it for Cannon Score. What the hell is that in the background? <laughs> Who knows? Doesn't matter! Okay, one final E rank game, please, please. Yes! Barely made it. A failure till the very end!